big deal. Oh no, it's very different than heated round brushes that have come before it and those who have tried to be like it. It is in a class of its own. So here it is in the navy. Notice there are two sizes. This is the one and a half inch. That's for you if you have shoulder length hair or longer or the one inch. That's for you if your hair is shorter than shoulder length. So navy, purple, both sizes, gray, and pink in the both sizes. It also comes with a fantastic bag. Normally, I don't care that much about the bags, except for I have this and I love this bag. It protects your countertop and it's easy to carry, so you get the bag. Just so you know, it's $129 value that you're getting home on four easy payments, $24.33. And I'm here with Maria McCool, who invented Hello. it. So good to, see, to see you. you too. Maria McCool comes to us from, you bring us all of these great Callista tools. Mm -hmm. She's the owner of a very prestigious, uh, prestigious, excuse me, I swallowed weird, very <laughs> prestigious <laughs> salon you. in the Philadelphia Thanks. area. Your clients were coming to you and saying, you give me a good cut, you give me good color, but when I get home, I can't style my hair. So you developed this whole line for them. Yeah, exactly, because it's true. I mean, it, it looks great when you leave the salon, you feel so pretty and so stylish, but it's important to us as stylists that you feel like that every day. So the reflector is one of the tools that I created specifically listening to what the clients now, our salon, we, I've had my salon for over, well, it was 25 years last month. And we hear the same things from clients day in and day out, that they want their hair to be easy to do at home. Now, so, I just want to say, yes. a lot of people who have hair that's about the length of Sue's yes. say, well, I can't really use a hot tool on my hair. It's too short. I'll burn my scalp. Right. And what you're going to see, we're even going to do shorter hair. Yeah. So what actually Sandra's talking about is, you know, when I developed the Perfector, there's two really important things. I perfectly aligned these teeth so that this way it'll glide through the hair real nice and hold it onto the barrel without the clamp. So you get no crimping, no singeing, no flattening of the two metal rods together. And also, when you get this, these teeth are gonna protect you from burning. I have this right on Sue's scalp. I'm not burning her. I'm touching it so when you touch it at home or you touch your scalp, you're not gonna burn yourself. And then what happens every time is you get this perfect volumized curl that has lift, oh, it's that has shine, shiny, that has body, yes. Yeah. So with Sue's hair, what you're gonna see is she's got this great natural texture. It's got a lot of curls, got fuzz, mm -hmm. which always comes with curly hair, right? I have the same thing. So how about we let it dry by itself and have Sue do it herself, right? Okay. Because so, we want you to see that she's gonna get volume and this body. This is pretty awesome. We're gonna move down the row here. No hairstylist is gonna come work with Sue. <laughs> I just wanna tell you that. She's gonna sit here and do her own with the little mirror. She doesn't even get a good big mirror here. QVC. And we're going to see how she can do her own hair just like that. But moving on, yes. I just want to tell you this. Yeah, it's at the highest. This is at its highest temperature of 395. It is adjustable. This just happens to be at the highest. And I want to show you what I'm doing. See, I'm rolling this on my hands. I'm clutching it. I do feel a definite warmth, but it's not burning my skin. So even if you, a young girl uses this or you've burnt yourself, I can't burn my neck. I can't burn my scalp. Forehead, it's, your yeah. ear, everything, exactly. right? Exactly. Everybody comes in scar wounds on their forehead, right. on their ears, and on their neck. speaking of burning, Blondes are scared of hot tools because it can singe hair that's already been really treated a lot. Exactly, and that's the other big difference is the technology of the Perfector. This is different than any styling tool you're used to. I developed it with a fusion technology. You can see this black barrel as opposed to a metal barrel. When you get it home, you're gonna be able to pick the perfect heat for your hair type. So 325 to 395, that turns on the fusion technology. What that is is ceramic technology, evenly heating the barrel, smoothing and shining your hair and then the ionic technology that's what's putting the moisture in and that's why you're going to get all that volume not just curl and you're going to find that it lasts all day long because that's what everybody's telling me like I love my perfector because once I do it it's like that all day yeah you know and what I just did here you were Sandra was just saying with blondes I used to tell my clients that had blonde hair be careful don't use the heat styling tools on it too much. If you have highly chemically treated hair, you know, don't use it on well, the ends. Well, actually, look at her before. So mm -hmm. in the before unstyled, she's got pretty hair. The color's spectacular. Mm -hmm. But in the after where you're using the perfector, she can go bouncy and full. She could even go straighter mm -hmm. and more polished. You have so many options. In fact, I always like saying, because you told me this, your daughter has long hair. Yes. And Maria caught her daughter one day just, <laughs> Stealing look, just my brushing perfect. her hair. Mm -hmm. And you said, well, why are you doing that? Because she wasn't curling it. She was brushing it. 
So what mm -hmm. was she doing? And this was when we first did the perfector and I was doing it with a lot of waves and stuff. When you brush your hair, if you can see in the before picture with Christy's hair there, Christy's hair, what we have is even if I just continue to brush, I'm brushing in shine, but I'm brushing in volume and I'm taking that kind of fuzziness off of her hair and just smoothing it. So if you're somebody who, when you style your hair, it just has that little roughness to it or that little bit of fuzz, it's not silky looking. Well, you know what's good? This is really good for people who, like myself, I'm not really good with a blowout. Right. So if you give me a round brush and a hair dryer, try as I might, my hair still isn't gonna look that smooth. I just don't get the right tension or something. Right. So if you don't love how you're blowing out your hair, here's how you go back and perfect it. Right. And then any place where you didn't get the blowout the way you wanted, now you have your hair looking smoother, shinier. Exactly, and so many. Now I do have to say, the one team gave me this blowout. Now you know how to do a blowout. So, but but if and so, but if I were doing it myself, I could not achieve this. And so then this is really nice. Right, then you can do it instead. Like yeah. The, and and. I just have had so many clients say to me, you know what, Maria, I just don't blow dry my hair anymore. Same with Phyllis. Let it dry by itself, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. And what we're doing, it's a cute little cut. It looks great, like flatter, crappy, how she had it. But how about when you want that extra umph, when you want that blowout look? And and I'm sure, because I told Phyllis when we first started selling the perfector, I'm going to use you for the heat styling tool. She looked at me like I was crazy because she, at this well, length. Phyllis had to, she had to have thought, you can't put a heat styling tool in my hat. First of all, I'm going right. to burn my scalp and then I'm going to burn my beautiful silver hair. Right, <laughs> exactly, exactly, both. And instead, because of the teeth, it's protecting me, the barrel from the heat so she can put it right on her scalp. I'm actually touching it. And yes, because of the fusion technology, your silver hair is not going to yellow. And that happens because that hot metal iron will singe it and scorch it, and then you start to get that yellowing of yeah, your yellow I hair. I love how, she has this cute little pixie yeah, cut that really does look great for, you know, kind of your daytime look. If you look at what's happening to her in the perfector, just by rolling brushing it through rolling, her hair yeah. and brushing it, she now has something very elegant, really polished. This is how she goes to dinner or to a boardroom meeting. Mm -hmm. It just really is so sophisticated. Right, and it's just, by brushing your hair. So if you can use a brush <laughs> and you can brush your hair, you're gonna be an expert at perfecting your hair because all you, it is is a brush. If you dry your hair and you still don't like how it looks because you don't like the blowout, this perfects it. No mm -hmm. product has a name that says it all like the perfector. <laughs> I mean, that's really what it does. It perfects your right, hair. Right, exactly, and it's true. It's just, you know, the whole reason why I created it is because I wanted mm -hmm. it to be very safe for your hair. I want it to be super, Sue, super simple. Sue, are you ready simple. for us? Do we give you enough time? Okay. So as we've been chatting, Sue's been perfecting her hair, mm -hmm. doing it herself. Oh, wow. Look what she's, she's fast. So she moved right through it. As I could see, she's gotten rid of all of her curl, the, the extra fuzz and frizz. But while she's doing it, what you notice is we've got some volume in it, right? Well, so that's pretty. That's the difference. Curling iron's gonna give you curl, but what happens is, because you're putting the hair between the two clamps, it's flattening the hair first, mm -hmm. and then trying to curl it. So in the before, I'm gonna just say, I think Sue's hair is really cute. Like, I like right. that texture. Yes, I think it's really adorable. But as women, we want options, we want mm -hmm. versatility. So mm -hmm. now she has the ability to take one cut and wear it a bunch of different ways just because she has the perfector. Now, I have to say, in the, in the back, the after, <laughs> I love that. So what she has all the curl, but it looks soft and controlled. Right, so if you're someone with curly hair, maybe even you have a perm, and you want to be able to get that look that they do when you leave the salon with your perm or your curly hair, mm -hmm. all you have to do is use the perfection section by section just like Sue did on her yeah. curly hair, and you're gonna get this really great blowout. You know what this is also really good for? If you, on the back of your head, have, and actually yes. right what you're about to do, uh -huh. if you have a cowlick, like I tend mm -hmm. to have one right here. Mm -hmm. So the first day you dry your hair, you're good. The second day <laughs> you wake up, you think you're good, and then you look in a mirror and you realize you have that cowlick, like mm -hmm. right a here. Flat spot. The, exactly, mm -hmm. or a flat spot. This will get rid of it. Yeah, just by coming in, and what you wanna do is over direct a little bit. What that means is you move the perfector forward in your section. See how it's a little bit forward right there? And then when you pop that out, you're gonna get all that lift, all that volume, and because again, it's not an iron, so we're not flattening her hair, 
we're infusing body into her hair and lift. I should let you know a lot of people are ordering this. In fact, there's something like 300 people on the phone right now just waiting to order. So if you want it, maybe go order QVC.com or do automated ordering. Just make sure you get the color you want, which I'm holding the gray. We have it in the pink, the navy, and the purple. Also, there's two sizes, the one and a half inch, which I'm holding. That's for you if you have shoulder length or longer. Okay. The one inch is for you if you have shorter, that shoulder length or shorter hair. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Now, Chrissy's Long definitely hair. using the one and a half inch. Right, we're using the one and a half inch. And when you see Chrissy's before, again, I just want to mention, no blow drying, right? Just naturally, you know, came in with her hair natural and then go through with the perfector. Now it's a little bit different on long hair. So how do you get these great waves, these great celebrity waves? See her before? Now wait, I have to ask you something. Yes. So in the before, obviously she's let it dry naturally. Yes. Um, maybe not her preferred look, but <laughs> you did not wash her blower out and style her to do this, no. right? You took that unstyled hair right. and just with the perfector got what you're doing now. Exactly what I'm doing right now. So you didn't cleanse and then dryer, you no. just went to work with the perfector. Exactly, and you see the fuzz before. Just every time you stroke through with the perfector, it will get silkier, it will get shinier, and it'll have more body. You start at the top, and you just spin and come down your whole entire section. As you can see, when I pull out, do you see the shine on that blonde hair? Which is very hard to get, but every time I take the perfector through, it gets shinier and shinier. Well, and you know, if you look at her unstyled, right. imagine that that's you after you've blow dried your hair, and you just feel like your hair looks a little fuzzy or frizzy, or you're not happy with the way you Get, you, you were drying it, use the perfector because it really does make everything just come together right. so much nicer. And here's another thing. We could have very easily done Chrissy's hair straight too as well. Okay. Now how you're gonna do that, the thing that it, what's so great about it is you can get as close as you want. I mean, my clients of, that are women of color, what they love is that they can go all the way in, they can have that perfector right on their scalp because it won't burn them give it a little bit of tension, and then all you have to do is come out straight. So you literally just use the heat of the perfector and you just come down straight with a little bit of tension like that and you can go for a very smooth, straight, shiny look without having the crimps and the clamps and the pressing and the flattening of a straightening iron. So now we just had her go completely straight, right? We just had that curled, but here's the difference. I can go back in there and curl that. Usually, as you know, right, Sandra, if you were using a straightening iron? Absolutely. Well, because after you use the straightening iron, you're done. Your yeah. hair is straight until you wash it. Right, exactly. Because those clamps literally press out any volume that's in the hair, yeah. right? So then you can't get it back. But look, I can recurl that right after straighten it and just have that curl right back in place. You know, if you're an American woman, <laughs> you have probably tried a lot of tools over your life yes, for your yes, hair. Yes. You probably liked some, some you hated, some you thought were a total waste of money. <laughs> If you're watching this and you think, okay, I've seen it all, that almost looks like the hot brush I used before. It's not. It's completely different technology. I would say give it a try. Use the Easy Pay. Get it home for four easy payments of $24.33. If you don't love it, just return it. Get your money back. We don't want you to keep anything you don't love. But give it a try. It looks like a tool maybe you saw in the past. It functions nothing like tools from the past. Right, right. You've put new technology in here and you've made it so user friendly. So user friendly that I'm holding a hot tool that is here heated up to 395, not heating up exactly. to. It's already 395 and I'm not burning myself. I've been holding it like this the whole time. So really a completely different concept in getting the hair you want. Awesome. Right. Just let us know what color you want. Do you want the gray? Do you want the navy? Do you want the pink? Do you want the purple? That's it, right? Navy, yep. purple, pink. It's like a pop quiz here. Wait, navy, <laughs> purple, gray, right, and pink. pink. Just let one us know what size, inch. one or one and a half inches. Over a thousand have been spoken for. So glad that you like it. And Maria, it's always so great to, you. See you. to see Thanks you. Thanks for making too. us all look so perfected. <laughs> all right, that's going to do it for me. Of course, you can always join me on my Facebook page, Sandra Bennett QVC. Hit like, and we're always chatting on there. But in the meantime, Shopping never stops at QVC. Let's see what Sean and Isaac have for us.